beep beep. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. I'm gonna be late. I'm gonna be late. Um, uh, no. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Um, uh, Mom, sweetie, it's late. You gotta go. I know, I know. Bye. Mwah. Mwah. Okay, gotta leave, gotta leave. Open the door. <sighs> okay, I'm here. Okay. Oh my gosh. Look at that long line. Come on, old man. I'm trying to get my passport. Huh. Oh, yeah, it's finally my turn. Here you go. Thank you. Please step in there for me, ma'am. Okay. Looks like you're good. You're free to go. Thank you. <sighs> I'm a little hungry. Uh, excuse me. Okay. Plane 2 is ready. Oh, that's me. Ooh, I want the one right next to the TV. Why, hello. Uh, um, hello? What's your name? Caitlin. That's nice. Where are you going? Why should I tell you? <laughs> um, would anybody like anything to drink? Could I have some orange juice, please? Yes. Here you go. Thank you. Mmm. <sighs> I'm so tired. Okay, everyone, the plane is about to land. Finally. <laughs> okay, um... Are you Miss Johnson? Yes, I am. Okay, hi, I'm Caitlin. Yes, I know you. Your dorm room is 2A. You're sharing with three other people. Okay. Bye, have a nice day. Okay, let's look around. Mm, looks like a study room. Classroom. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. What are you doing in my classroom? Uh, I'm new, so I was just looking around. I I'm sorry, I'll leave. Yeah, you better leave. Okay, weirdo. Hmm, okay. Uh, hey, do you know where the dorm rooms are? <laughs> Go find them yourself. Jeez. Um, okay. Oh, food. I'll be back here later. Okay, this is my dorm room. 2A. Okay, well, this is the place. Hello? Is anyone here? Um, gee, who are you? Um, I'm Caitlin. Why are you in this dorm room? Um, I'm new. I, I stay here. I'm 2A. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Marcus! What? Marcus, Marcus, Marcus. Yeah? There's somebody in your dorm. What? Who? Wait, what? See, Marcus, I told you. Uh, who are you? <sighs> I stay in this apartment. I'm new here. I'm 2A. Oh, okay. Let me go get Kayla. <laughs> hey, I'm Caleb. Hi, I'm Caitlin. Kayla, didn't I tell you to knock next time? Well, 2A is here. Come on. Oh, yes. Hey, girly. Hey. I'm Kayla. What's your name? I'm Caitlin. Here, let me show you where you're going to be sleeping. Okay. So here's our room. This is my corner, and this is your corner. It's very bland right now, but I have some decorations for you. Thanks. Here, let's get you set up. Here's your locker. Um, there's a cockroach in there. Oh, um, that always happens one second. Okay, I'm back. Okay, there you go. And then here's a box of decorations that you can use. Thanks. Here, I'll leave you to it. Bye. Bye. <sighs> okay, here's my desk poster she even gave me a laptop looks like some pens and pencils Ooh, a water bottle and a notepad okay let me empty my backpack put my books down here then i'll put my notepad in here a little plant hang up my uniform and my phone Ooh, look at this cute oh my gosh um, let's get rid of that another bug yeah Ooh, cute here i'll give you some posters you're giving me beach vibes, so here, have these. Thanks. Okay, well, let me show you around. So here's where we wash our clothes, of course. Then over here is the bathroom. There's a little door right here. And then this is where we get our mail. Here's our air hockey table. Ooh, fun. This is our living space. That's Maggie and that's Marcus. They're dating, obviously. Okay. In our fridge, we all have it divided up. 1A, 1B, 2A, and 2B. As you can tell, that one's Marcus. He plays a lot of basketball. He's really sporty, and he thinks he has to eat a lot of healthy food. <laughs> you don't have anything in yours right now, but it's okay. You can share with me. Here are food cabinets, 1A and 1B. And of course, Caleb has all the snacks, so sometimes I like to steal from him. <laughs> and then 2A and 2B. Right now, you only have jam, but it's okay. And then here's the boys' dorm room. He has his headphones on, so he can't hear us. Here's Caleb's side of the room. Aliens, weird things, you know, him. And then here's Marcus's side of the room. Trophies, because he's so great, you know. He's a loser. <laughs> okay, well, that's the dorm. This is a cool place. 
Let's see what time it is. We don't want to be late to class. <gasps> we have five minutes until class starts. Okay, I gotta quickly get my uniform. Okay, let's go. Marcus, you realize class starts in three minutes. What? Oh, no. Maggie, get out. What? <sighs> Why is she here all the time? She doesn't even live in this dorm. So annoying. Caleb. Caleb. What? what? Class starts in two minutes. What? Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Okay, let me get my bag, water bottle, books, jersey, phone, laptop. I think that's it. Okay, let's go. Caleb, don't you need anything for class? Nah, I'm good. He never brings anything. Marcus, what are we doing here? I need my protein shake before we go to class. Oh my gosh. One protein shake, please. Here you go. Thanks. Could I get one coffee, please? Yep. Could I also have a coffee? Mm-hmm. Thank you. Could I get one sub sandwich, please? Hey, love. What? I'm hungry. Here you go. Thanks. <laughs> Let's go to class. Everyone go hurry. Kayla, Caleb, and Marcus, you're late. And I don't know who you are, but you're late too. Sorry, my name is Caitlin. Well, Caitlin, you're late. <laughs> well, sorry, it's my first day. I didn't know where I was going. Are you talking back to me? Sorry. Go to the principal's office now. Why, but it's her first day. You want to join her? <sighs> <sighs> well, hello there, Caitlin and Kayla. I thought you said you wouldn't be in the principal's office anymore, Kayla. Remember we talked about this? I'm sorry, Mom. Why are you two here anyway? We were late to class. Late to class again? What have I... <laughs> I've talked to you about this. I'm sorry. You're getting detention, Kayla. But I'm your daughter. You can't give me detention. I just did. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, Miss Johnson, that I was late. Now, why were you late? I I'm new here, and I just got here today, and uh, Kayla was giving me a tour. She's super nice, by the way. You have an amazing daughter. Oh, she's giving you a tour? I don't like these excuses. Mom, it's literally not an excuse. I was giving her a tour. You can ask Caleb, Maggie, and Marcus. Whatever, you both have detention. Mom, it's her first day you can give her detention. I can do whatever I want. I'm the principal. Oh, whatever. <sighs> I can't believe I got detention on my first day of school. Let's go. Hey, what happened in there? Kayla and I got detention. What? But the principal is Kayla's mom. I know, right? You two stop flirting. Uh, what? Now back to class. Okay, so what does everybody want to be when they get older? We'll start with you, Michael. And you know what? I'm going to have you all come to the front of the class and say it. Oh my gosh. Okay. I want to be a DJ, just like my dad. Great answer. Now go sit down. Okay, Ashley. I want to be a college teacher just like you. <laughs> That's why you're my favorite. <laughs> Albert, I want to be a scientist. Good answer, good answer. Marcus, I want to be a professional football player. <laughs> in your dreams. Okay, now I'm going to sit down. <sighs> Caleb, I don't know what I want to be yet. You're in college. This class is what you want to be. What are you doing here if you don't know what you're going to be? I don't know. My mom made me come here. Just go sit down. Caitlin, I want to be an interior designer. Boring. Go sit down. Ugh. Kayla, I want to be a veterinarian. You and animals do not mix. Now go sit down. Ugh. Rude. Okay, well, class is over. Get out of here. <sighs> Finally. I don't know who that teacher is, but she's so dumb. I know, right? She's my least favorite teacher. Marcus, how was your class? It was really good, actually. How was your class? Terrible. Because I wasn't with you, Marcus. I think I'm going to be sick. Same. Anyways, move, Caleb. I want to study with Marcus. No, I was here first. I said move. <clears throat> hey, you just pushed me out of my seat. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, finally back to our dorm. Oh, looks like our test papers came in. Oh, yeah, A+. Plus. Oh, I want to see what I got. Oh, yeah, an F. You know an F isn't good, right? But it's better than my last grade. Last time, I got a C. Like, <laughs> you realize a C is better than an F, right? No, it isn't. <laughs> Weirdo. Okay. Let's see what I got. What? An F? <sighs> Let's see what I got. A C? Mm, not that bad. C is pretty bad. It's better than an F. No, it isn't. Why is everybody saying that? I really got an F and detention on my first day of school? <sighs> Oh, 
throw that away. It's Marcus's turn to make lunch this time, so be prepared. What? Why? Marcus thinks we all have to eat healthy just like him, so we won't get anything good out of this lunch. Lunch is ready. There's no way I'm eating this for lunch. What are you doing? Eating my lunch? <gasps> what? We're just having one single egg that's not even cooked all the way for lunch? And what even is that drink? Protein shake. <sighs> uh. See, it was really good. Okay, well class is starting soon, so let's go. <sighs> again? Okay, let's go. Okay, here we are again. Okay, I'll be right back. I have to use the bathroom. Marcus! I didn't know you were in this class. Well, I am. <laughs> Whose stuff is that? <gasps> why is my stuff on the floor? Maggie, why are you in my spot? My stuff was there. Mm, you were gone, so <laughs> I took it. <laughs> my stuff was there. Class is about to start. Go find somewhere else to sit. <sighs> this class was really boring because I wasn't even sitting by Kayla. And we did a test, and of course, I got an F. Again. Caitlin, can you come to my office with me? Uh, sure. It's okay, leave your stuff. Okay, have a seat. Do you see what's on my screen right now? A test paper? Yep, and do you see the grade? An F? Correct. This is your paper right here. You've been getting an F all day today. And today's your first day. And you even got detention. Well, it wasn't my fault that I was getting detention. Like, it was my first day. I didn't know where I was going. And all these teachers are mean. They gave me an F on purpose. No, you clearly made a lot of mistakes in this essay. If you keep it up, you're gonna have to be kicked out of this college. Your essay to get into this college is perfect. I hate to say it, but Caitlin, this college is for A plus students, not Fs. This is a private college. But Caleb gets C's and F's all the time. Why isn't he kicked out of the college? Well, that's different, okay? Not really. Ring, ring, ring. Is that a phone that I hear? Oh, yeah, sorry, it's in my pocket. Give it to me right now. What? <laughs> this is college. Are we not allowed to have our phones on us? My school, my rules. Give it. <sighs> so first you give me detention for something that I can't even control. Then you threaten to kick me out of the college. And you take my phone? <sighs> yeah, finally she's gone. <gasps> Did she just put my phone in a safe? There you guys are, I've been searching for you all everywhere. What happened in my mom's office? She was talking about how bad my grades were and threatened to kick me out of school. What? No way. And then my phone went off and she locked it in a safe. My mom doesn't have a safe in her office. That's what I thought. But then she took like a picture off of a wall and there was a safe behind it. No way. Well, I mean, maybe you should be a better student. Like this school is for advanced kids, not just regular public school kids. Whatever, Maggie. I was really wanting to call my mom to tell the news, but you know, got my phone taken away. Well, you can always use my phone. Here. Wait, where's my phone? Maybe you misplaced it? N no, I had it in my bag. Did one of you all take my phone? No, no. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm freaking out. Where's my phone? You don't think my mom put it in her safe, do you? No, she's your mom. Why would she do that? Yeah, I guess you're right. Well, I gotta head to basketball practice. I'll be back. Come on, dude. Ooh, 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 ooh. Huh. Yeah! Yeah, go Marcus! You're so cool, Marcus. You're so good at this game. Dude, tell your girlfriend to move. Ah, you're just mad that you didn't win. <laughs> For two hours, I studied because I did not want to get kicked out of this college. My mom really wanted me to go here, so I wanted to make her proud. <sighs> Guys, it's getting late. We should maybe go back to our dorm. Yeah. Marcus, let's go. Okay, coming. Wait. Where's my phone? Your phone's missing too? Yeah, I had it in here, now it's gone. That happened with Kayla too. Hmm. Okay, now that we're back to our dorm, I need to find my phone. It's not anywhere. <gasps> and where's my camera? What do you mean? One of my hobbies is photography, and I keep my camera on that shelf, and now it's gone. Oh no. Hey, where's my DS? It was right here. Dude, something's wrong. While everyone was eating dinner, I was still trying to figure out what was happening to all our electronics. Something isn't right. We all lost our electronics today? And today I saw Miss Johnson put my phone in a safe. 
a hidden safe. Mm, yeah, something isn't right. Ew, chew with your mouth closed. Hmm. Well, I'm off to bed. I gotta wake up early for basketball practice tomorrow. Yeah, I'm tired too. I just wanna play my DS. While everyone was asleep, I left the dorm. I headed to the classes. It was weird seeing it so dark and so empty. I went to the principal's office. She wasn't there, so that was good. I took the picture off the wall and found the safe. Oh no, I need a code. Hmm, where would it be? Hmm, here? Nope. Um, here. Oh yes, this is the code. Oh my gosh, it's everybody's electronics. I grabbed my backpack and stuffed it with everything. Oh my gosh, my phone. Okay, well, I gotta close that back up so she doesn't suspect anything. I sat down and took out my phone. I went through to see if anything was missing, and I was shocked. Apps were open that I didn't even open. It looks like she read my messages. I cannot believe this. The principal went through my phone. I need to head back to my dorm. I have to wake up the others and tell them. Kayla, Kayla. Hmm, what? So I couldn't stop thinking about how all of our electronics were missing. So I decided to head to the principal's office. I found the code to the safe and well, O-M-G. You found her stuff in my mom's office. But at least you found her stuff. Let's go show the others. Caleb. Huh? Mm, what is it? Look what I found. No way. You found my DS. Yup. Where'd you find it? In Mrs. Johnson's office, it was like in a hidden safe. Why would she do that? I don't know. Marcus. Mm. What is it? I have to get up early. Look what I found. Whoa, what? Where'd you get this? Kayla's mom's office. How did she take it and why did she take it? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Thank you so much, Caitlin. You're such a great friend. <laughs> Thanks. I gotta call my mom. Mom, you won't believe what happened. I told her everything and she was so shocked. No way. You have to tell the cops or somebody. She took your phone. You paid for that with your own money. Imagine how she would feel if you took her phone and went through it, especially her messages. <sighs> Just be safe. <laughs> I will, Mom. I love you. Bye. After that long day, I needed a good night's rest. <sighs> oh, so you're finally awake. How long was I asleep for? Well, you went to bed at 1 and class starts in... 10 minutes. 10 minutes? Oh no. Everyone, let's go. We're going to be late. When I walked in the school, I heard yelling. I peeked in the principal's room and this is what I saw. I mean, yes, I did take the children's phones. But, but listen, I... I mean, they were... No more excuses. She also threatened to fire me if I didn't give the students bad grades and was mean to them. She said the children deserved to be yelled at. I did not. I've heard enough. You're fired. Take your stuff and leave. Oh, aren't you sad that your mom is getting fired? Eh, not really. Why? Growing up, she never really took care of me. My dad always took care of me. She was always gone at work and never came to any of my sports games. And she was mean to me too, so eh, I don't really care. But that means school will be better for me. <laughs> a few months later, we had a new principal. College finally felt like a normal school. But Maggie was mad because Marcus broke up with her. I kind of have a thing for Marcus, but... Hopefully he doesn't find that out sooner or later. A few years later, we all graduated. We were all best friends and going to continue being best friends out of college. Well, except for Maggie. I will say the first two days of college were crazy. So much happened in the first day, I don't even know how to explain it. But yeah, overall college is pretty fun. I can't believe I'm graduating. Same, it's so amazing. We should move in right next to each other and then like whenever we have kids, like they can be best friends and it'll be so amazing. <laughs> You know, Marcus, I'm so mad at you. Okay. Do you not even care that you broke my heart? Mm, not really. <laughs> Whatever. I knew you were going to do this. I didn't even like you. Then why'd you date me? I don't know. I, ju I just didn't like you. You were, like, so ugly. Like, I did not even like you. And then we can hang out every day and our husbands will be, like, best friends. And then our kids will be, like, best friends and hang out every single day. And then they'll turn out like us. And then they'll move in together. And then their husbands will, like, you know, be best friends. And then their kids will be best friends. And it will start all over again. 